Friday Night Football number 121. It is our final. Wesley taking on Pavin for $1,000. Should be a fantastic game. Nick Mazesco and Tyler Davis along with us. We want to thank our sponsor of Friday Night Football. Once again, it is all presented by the Army National Guard. For more information, head on over to nationalguard.com backslash esports. Ty, this Infinite's really not happy that Pavin did what he did to win the game. He's really unhappy about it. <laughs> Yeah, very, un very not happy there. But what a finals we got. Two 818 members, Wesley, Pavin, offensive masterminds, $1,000 on the line. Of course, the FNF Cup standings at stake here. Big time matchup. Chat, who we got? Let us know in the chat. Who do we got? Give me a one in the chat if you're rocking with Wesley Gittins. Give me a two in the chat if you're rocking with FaZe Pavin. It will be Pavin with the ball first. Oh, a new a new update to my microphone. Oh, remind me later. Third and nine. Randall Cunningham back to pass. Wesley got the best offense on the planet. Second best. I'll still take Henry just because you beat him. So, yep. but Wesley, Wesley's an <laughs> offensive yeah. mastermind. Yeah. Henry's just a little bit more balanced on both. That's why. But yeah, Wesley offensively is fire. But hey, Wesley's defense looking good. Big fourth and 23. Uh-oh. Fourth and 23. Arm punt action. Going the other way is Wesley. 25, 20, 15, Ooh. 10, 5. Okay, how's that bad boy? We'll start things off with a defensive touchdown. Wesley Gittens goes up six. Night train lane with the pick six right there. Pavin really had no choice. It was 4th and 23. He had to kind of throw it up. One-on-one -on -one streak. But Wesley clicks on, gets the user pick, and takes it to the Krabowski. Just like that, seven, nothing. Ty, I didn't think he had a chance to take that back. And all of a sudden, the lane opened up, and Wesley said, thank you very much. We're making a house call. Yeah, that was big time right there. We'll see if Pavin can respond. Infinite says, Wesley got the best offense on the planet. I like it. They're both good players, real GM. Yes, they are. Two of the best in the world, in the entire world. You see Pavin bouncing right back. Nice little dot right there. You know Pavin. There's no quit in Mr. Phase. Those is one away. I mean, I'm telling you, FaZe could not do better than, than, than Pavin. I mean, talk about a guy mm -hmm. who not just is motivated and is a great representative of the Madden community, but uh, uh, an all-around great person, somebody who... Uh, certainly knows won't ever get into any PR trouble. Uh, plus, he's got the, mm -hmm. you know, the social media brains behind him. And uh, I mean, come on. I mean, what more can he ask for? Exactly. Professional, class act, you know, says all the right things, does all the right things, and then has the skill and the talent to back it up. So couldn't, you couldn't think of a better, like, for, for, if there was anyone in the Madden community to represent us, you couldn't think of a better option than, than Pavin. Hands it off, cuts it back inside, and Pavin, he'll score pretty quickly. How about three plays off the pick six to answer Wesley's touchdown with this extra point, 2.21 to go in the first quarter. It's up, it's good, and we're all tied up. A little sweep call right there, too. Gets to the outside, cuts it back in. Like you said, tie ball game between these two goons. Reggie Jackson has 16. Marcus Morris has 16. Nobody else has more than eight. The third leading scorer is 
the goon, Evita Zubac. <laughs> yeah, also, wow, Brandon that's rough. I thought, uh, yeah. I thought Terrence Mann would do a little bit more here. Norman Powell, too. I thought those two would kind of step up. With no Norman PG. Powell's three for 11 from the field. Wow. Norman Powell's taking 11 shots. Good Lord. Oof. Shit, Ingram's got 18. Wow. Ingram's got 18. He's the only player. So, uh, on, La Larry, Larry Nance. Nance has 10 and 9 Cleveland right now. Cavalier a, legend. A oh, Larry oh, Nance. Showing up in the do or die game. Let's throw back across his body. First pass completed for Joe Namath. Give him a second and six. Joe Namath. Look for Dickerson here on that angle route. Out of the backfield, good user though from Pavin. Never mind, he left it. Polo Stub in the chat. What's going on, man? Thanks What's for hanging Polo out with Stubb? us on this Friday night. Almost Saturday morning for some of you. Yeah, true. Seventeen minutes away. Name of first and ten. Wesley right. looking left side. He'll complete it over the left side. A little dump off to the fly to pick up a couple. Yeah, he was a little late with that read. Had him way earlier. Probably could have got more yardage if he hit him earlier. Dotty dot dot. What's going on, man? Thanks for hanging out with us. Friday Night Football number 121. Presented by the Army National Guard. I miss saying it, Nick. You know, last week I had to do the traffic. This week you're doing it. Yeah, what'd you think? Oh, that was a beam. Oh, my. <laughs> Wesley dropping that one in the Ooh. bucket for a touchdown. Beam from Joe Namath. What do you think? How'd you how you like how'd you like precision. how'd you like steering the ship through the the sponsor waters? You, you know, listen. You're not you're first not of all, my job. I don't want to take your job. I'm very <laughs> glad to be in the spot I am here. You know, you can handle all the traffic you want, but the more I do it, I feel like I get better at it. But you know, I'd yeah. rather not do it as much. <laughs> the more I do it, I, I get sure. better at it. I don't want to do it anymore though. So. <laughs> yeah, exactly but i mean like ty like we couldn't we couldn't leave it to user i mean what are we crazy oh man uh, yeah i know right you know when i get stiff or bugs you know they kind of handle it i get user first thing he always says to me he's like nope td you handle it all <laughs> all right man you got this Have fun. Oh, user's the best he's the best Ooh, big swat. Okay. I mean, it was a it was a beam. How did he catch that? He put it in his hands. Throw underneath for Pavin. And probably will take us to the end of the first quarter. Their score 14 to 7. Wesley with the edge. He'll get the ball to start the second half. Pavin's going to look to take advantage of this second quarter, maybe get a defensive stop of his own. Hold on, let's check in. Did the Guardians get one hit? They got three hits. Let's go. Including Jose Ramirez. Let's Ooh. go, baby. They play because they went up against Rodon, right? Yeah, Rodon went Hello, seven innings, Rodon. one earned. Not bad. Ramirez had an RBI double. Over the top, he's wide open. This one, too easy for Pavin Lockhart. Face Pavin with a touchdown. A little bit of a shootout here. Back and forth we go. Yeah, Rodon struck out nine. He's a 1-5 ERA. You guys good? Yeah, yeah, he's a beast. I'm just glad he's with the Giants now, and I don't have to to see him in the division yep either of you into UFC I feel like he's gonna be I feel like he's he gets better too as he uh as he, he gets older for some reason like when he first started out he was kind of rocky now he's like really good he was just he was just wild but yeah yeah, yeah. he got 21 strikeouts in what two starts yeah that's crazy like, struck, struck out 12 against the Marlins struck out 9 today like Austin lost. 
Yeah, we've been struggling. We lost two to the Yankees. We kind of got destroyed today by the Twins, to be honest. 8-4. I mean... I feel like our pitching Austin's is just bad. It was last year. We made eight. a run, but... It was, it was a 5-4 game in the 8th. Or it was a 6-4 game in the 8th, and then... Oh, okay. Uh, I was watching it early. It was like 4-1 or something. So was, I was like, was, oh, this is over. Matty Barnes? Yeah, Matt Barnes gave up two earned. Yeah, our pitching's not good. Besides Ivaldi, Eval, uh, I, I don't think we're Nathan. Good. Nathan Ivaldi. I yeah. bet it was not good today. I mean, he was, I mean, yeah. four earned. He's okay. He's kind of mid. He reminds me of your guy, please, Zach. Like, just kind of, you know. Just all Nick right. Vetta has a 939 ERA, so he's not Zach, like, please, Zach. Don't, <laughs> don't insult Zach, please, Zach, by comparing him to a 9 ERA <laughs> guy. Easy there, Namath. Looking down the sidelines. <laughs> got him, Kyle Pitts, inside the red zone. That's too easy for Wesley. He had, like, a million things open right there. Hesitated, but then he hits the wheel. Too easy for Mr. Gittins. The one thing I'm excited about is, you know, flying to Kansas City tomorrow. We're going to the Royals Tigers game, which doesn't sound great, as that's a easy little little S corner route. But it, it, listen, it's not exciting because it's you know it's two rebuilding teams. But you think about it, you can see Spencer Torkelson and Bobby Witt. I mean, two of the great young players. Yeah, going head to head plus Kauffman Bobby Witt. Stadium Bobby Witt's kind of a stud. Bobby Witt's a beast, but and plus Kauffman Stadium is like a kind of a bucket list baseball place for me. And one of those. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I mean, if Riley Green wasn't hurt, Austin Meadows would be playing. Meadows has been raking. Mm -hmm. uh, who is the who is projected to start tomorrow? Projections: Matt Manning and Chris Bubich. Bubik. He is 0-1 with a 67.5 ERA. So, not great. Oh, uh, I would say man. not ideal. And what's his name? Javi Baez, like, hasn't played for them in a while. Like, he's been, like, scratched every day or something. Some type of injury. Oh, the this Tigers. is the guy that started against Cleveland um, in the game that Cleveland won 17-3. He gave up five earned in two-thirds of an inning. Oh, cool. We might see some offense tomorrow. I'm in there. What time's the game? Matt Manning. Seven, like, seven Eastern? Uh, it's like 310 Central. Oh, okay. So I, I literally, I land in Kansas City at like 1230, and I'm just going to like Uber straight to the game. Yeah. Go get some food and like just chill there. You have you don't have like luggage or anything because you only you said you're only going for like 24 just, hours, right? Yeah, I'm literally just bringing my backpack. Yeah. So. Yeah, I'll like. Just I'll wait for my uh, in-laws to get there, and God, I might not even bring a backpack. I'm literally it's literally 24 hours. Like, yeah. I might just bring like a, a change of shirt because I like I fly out Saturday or Sunday night at six. Oh, wow. Yeah. Bring your fanny pack. What's up, Scotty? Scott Cole in the building. Probably, probably fit a shirt. Yeah. And a fanny you, should, pack. you should do the fanny pack. I see. I, see I, should, just wear, I should just wear three shirts. <laughs> just... Change shirts and take it off. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Uh, Infinite, you can you can catch Scott Cole every uh, Tuesday afternoon uh, across social media on the Scott Cole and Nick Nesco podcast. Also, find us on Spotify or Apple Podcasts or wherever. Yes, okay, Infinite. I don't, li listen. You want to just keep talking about how bad we are at our jobs and how much you miss Scott Energy? <laughs> like, I mean, that's fine. Like, MySpace, yeah, LinkedIn. Yep. Uh, what are some other old social medias that are gone? Zanga? What was that video one? What was that video player that Vimeo? they had for a while there? Vimeo, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's still around. It's still a thing, them. apparently. 
No, no, no. There was one. Maybe it's a different one. I don't know. They had a, they had a couple of those. It was like TikTok before TikTok. They were like little clip videos. Vine. Vine. That Vine. was it. Yes. Yes. That, that's it. Find me on Vine. In the Scott Cole voice. Do it for the Vine. Hang on it. Do it for the Vine. Hang on it. Good block. Spin move inside. Walks into the end zone. Popping with the answer. Eric Dickerson again. Two touchdowns on that sweep. Last time it was to the left. This time to the right. And here we go again. Back. Tied. 21-21. Is there any squads? Mutt tournaments? I mean, at this point in the year, I doubt it. Get nasty, but maybe. I, I just, this, this time of the year, it would surprise me. Who got PS5 Uno? Like the card game? Oh, Infinite. Yeah, I mean, RG and Scott. I mean, yeah. I'm like, whatever, man. Like, that's cool. We're like Joe Buck and Troy Aikman. Nobody. <laughs> <laughs> Is that not it? Is that not the move? <laughs> <laughs> Never forget, I got to call Who'd one you, game with Scott you see the the... CS. It was myself, yeah. Scott Cole, and Cookie Boy. Big shout out to my guy, Cook. What a squad. Do you what see the new indeed. Thursday night? The new Thursday night uh, Amazon thing? I Kirk, think it's it's uh, Kirk and Kirk Al Michaels. With uh, Al Michaels, yeah. yeah. That'll be interesting. Second and five. Good left side. That's Ooh. a tough throw, but good click on. And it is caught at the 45 yard line. Time out? Why is he not calling timeout? Oh, okay. He's going to wait and kick it over. Yeah, 62 from can. there? Yeah, that's tough, but he can. He's got more. I guess I need one more play for the card game. Well, I'm in the middle of the tournament, and also I don't have a PS5. But... Yeah, Madden 17 must have been a fun year to call Madden. Like, like 16, 17, and nope, he, he did it. not make that. Wow. Did not make it. Second half, all tied up. Wes is getting the ball first. I mean, 17, like 16, 17, 18 had to be, like, especially 16, 17 had to be awesome. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The Cody Parkey special. Man, I can't wait to eat after this. I'm literally looking at DoorDash right now. I'm like, what can Are you I order? Uh, yeah are you gonna even how much so how many hours of sleep can you even get so three eastern i mean 3 a.m your time wait i'm confused like, what time if did you i say went did you to again? sleep right after this like i'd get well let's see how long will this game last so if it ends at 11 o'clock my time <laughs> another two hours um no i like <laughs> if i go to sleep like i could sleep for about six hours um okay. i won't like i'll get some food I'll probably yeah. get two or three hours. Um, my buddy's working at the lounge until three, so I'll probably go up there until three and then drive to the airport. And then, like, but I get, I, it's, I have two flights. It's here to Dallas and then Dallas to, to KC. So, uh, I mean, yeah, yeah. I'll get some sleep on the plane. Yeah. I intentionally uh, upgraded to first class for this flight. It was like 120 extra bucks. And I was like, yeah, I'm going to want that room to sleep. So, I'm just yeah. going to crash and just, I'll get, Nick don't need no sleep. Wrong, Polo. Nick, Nick definitely needs sleep. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Especially when he's going what to, you know, going with the end Oh, I'm probably going to cook up some just chicken fingers or something. Maybe put them in a little buffalo sauce. Something quick. That Omaha coming in clutch? Yeah, we'll see. Joseph, Joseph name. 10, throw on the right side, ED, spin move, Ooh. spin move, he'll pick up eight. Somebody, uh, somebody in the chat, tell me what I should order for food. Either specific restaurant or cuisine. Uh, no Taco Bell would slap right now. Infinite, please don't make. Ooh, Taco Bell always would slap. Ooh, Nacho Bell oh, Grande. Man. I miss eating that stuff, man. Ooh. 
Where are we go where are we gonna get lunch, TD? Back at the end zone. Got it. Beam. Touchdown for Wesley. I know. What do we do? Should we? I don't know. Should we? Should we do? Well, we do this in person. I come up. I come up wherever you're at, and then we go out to maybe eat after if it's not too late. But I don't know. I figure something out. Yeah. Yes, Tyler Davis and I will be in the same city next week. It'll be my first time seeing Tyler Davis in person in two years. In maybe even more than that. Uh, last time we saw each other over two was years. Challenge February. Of so that was. Because that was my birthday weekend, January to February okay. one. So yeah, like, yeah. okay, yep. So it's over to you, uh, bro. Yeah, two. Scott, I'll be in Boston next weekend. Um, yeah. So the last time we saw us was Jan was like beginning of February twenty. Yep. Yeah, I know. Scott, what's the name of the um the barbecue place I need to eat in KC? Because I got twenty four hours, so I need to like plan to go to this. Place. Oh yeah, yeah. Because you're gonna Scott be there. and RG like cannot stop talking. Hey. To me. Yeah, they always talk about it. <laughs> I remember. Q39. <laughs> I'm literally writing it down on my phone right now. Let me go to my notes. <laughs> They're like, why do you have a note that just says Q39? Shut up. I'm fat. <laughs> I need it. Q39. Got it. Clippers are Clippers are up eight now. What happened? Wow, see? And Clippers, they're pretty tough, man, even without PG. Like Well, what happened? Been doing it all year. Scored, has scored four points in the third quarter. Yeah, what's up with CJ McCollum too? He's only got eight points. Four for fourteen, oh four from three. Wow. The Cl Pelicans are one for thirteen from three. Wow. I mean, they're just, they're getting, they're getting worked. It's a good defense from Wesley for the third and 11. Oh, he had the tight end. Okay. Oh, he's got oh, that the top. Oh. And he missed him. Oh, he missed him. Scott, wow. I, I've been quiet for the last, like, two minutes because I'm literally on their website. <laughs> so, <laughs> I want to talk about it. I'm unhappy that I'm, like, stop. They have brisket burgers. They grind their brisket. They butcher it and grind it in-house and make burgers out of their brisket. Like, stop. Stop. End zone. Touchdown. Pop and Lockhart. Face Pop with another beam. I'm looking at I'm looking at Q39 too now. Oh, I guess it's not okay. Their website's just so nice too. Like the first homepage. It's yeah. So y'all want to like meet me at Q39? Like, what are we doing? <laughs> Here you go, chat. That's... So you guys can all experience it. I mean, thoughts. Give me some thoughts on that. Damn, yeah, this looks really good. Oh. Yeah. I mean, I'm literally just going to get the judge's plate and get some spare ribs, some brisket, and some chipotle sausage. Yeah, the chipotle sausage is... Look pretty good. Sounds too. amazing. They have pork belly and sausage corn dogs. Hello? I missed that. Where <laughs> did that happen? Oh. They have wings. They oh my god. Oh Lord. Yeah, look at all like the combo plates, too. Judge's plate. You get the brisket, spare ribs, pulled Pick pork, off. smoked. Pop and plays defense. Mike them. Haynes with the interception. Oh, look at the tackle from from Joey Namath. That's a big turnover because you know now Pavin, he's going to try to use this clock. Brisket burger. Oh, man. Yeah, GG's. Yeah, so Scott, I'll see you there. Ty, you just want to like fly in and then. 
Yeah, I'm booking uh, my flight now. Park, you can like drive down or whatever. Just make the drive from Michigan. Hey, you know. <laughs> this is the finals, G Blood. <laughs> As we cross officially into Saturday on the East Coast. Hope y'all are doing well. Nick Mazzesco, Tyler Davis, along with you. Second and six. Eric Dickerson, first down. But here's the thing, like, you also have to, like, think, I have to think smart. Because, like, yes, could I get Taco Bell? Sure. But then I also have to think, I have to be on an airplane tomorrow morning, and do I really want that yeah. in my body? Like, that could really that just come sounds back like to haunt you. Hurt. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that could haunt you on the airplane. Uh, Infinite, you would be correct, sir. Or ma'am, I don't know. Don't want to assume. Twenty eights up, second and short. Another run for Dickerson. There's no answer. Wesley has no run defense. This Pavin has just been running at will. Yep, you see him taking that clock going down. Smart veteran savviness of Pavin Lockhart. Yoshi in the chat. What's up, Yosh? Madden 93 on Sega, really the only real skill gap. Looking over the top, left side, beam, touchdown, pop it. How about uh, NFL Quarterback Club 99? Anyone remember that one on N64? Uh, not really. I was more of a um NFL game day guy before. Uh, oh, with okay. Okay. I was PlayStation NFL game day. NFL. Anyone remember like NFL Fever? You remember NFL Fever on Xbox? That game was pretty fun. Yeah, yeah, I remember NFL Fever. Yo, yeah. so okay, gotta tell this story. So we were in Houston. We went to this place. If you're ever in Houston, uh, yeah, Fever had Elway on it. Houston has this place called um, Cider Arcade. Yeah. They brew their own like cider. It's like cider, seltzers, and kombuchas. And then they also Ooh. have, they then took where their their brewery is, and they outfitted their uh, this big warehouse with like 150 to 200 arcades. And they're all like you pay 10 bucks to get in, and it's just free play. You can play whatever games you want. They've got like stuff back to like like Galaga to like. Um, you know, early early two thousand stuff. They had like like one of the original Time Crisis machines. They had like they had some newer stuff. They had the combination NBA Game Time and NFL Blitz two thousand and two, <laughs> and it was out of order. Ooh. Oh no! It hurt. I was so oh, sad. Yeah, Dig my Dug. God. Um, what's the Don Bluth game? Uh, uh, Dragon Slayer. I was so sad, dog. I cannot tell you how sad yeah. I was. Yeah, yeah. They got a little place like that around here. It's, it's like a cider place, but arcades in near Salem, with the you know the Witch City, and uh, they have they have right NFL side. Blitz there. Super fun. They have NBA Jam uh, I, too. And, and I was literally NFL about to Blitz. park it. I forgot how good NBA Game Time was. Like NBA Game Time was. Enough right side. So what's now on the on the clock chewing? Both have three timeouts. Who's gonna call the first one? <laughs> well, you know Wesley's gonna try to score or go for two here, like we saw Pavin do last round. Try to win it. Will Pavin get a taste of his own medicine? Or will he come up clutch with some defense? <laughs> Yoshi. Scott showing his age. Oh boy. NFL 2K. Yeah, 2K was cool. The old ones. 2K5. Breaking oh, tackles down arm. to the three yard line. Uh, Warhawk, they made so many of those, the, the plug and play systems. They made so many. That was the. 
when no joke i didn't get so i didn't get a video game system until i was a senior in high school that was a, a nintendo gamecube the, the first video game system i got my parents were like we got you a video game system i was so excited it was a plug and play and i cried like i was so sad when they they gave me this like little namco plug and play system what we got you a video game system stop complaining like <laughs> <laughs> what's the first madden you played nick uh um QB sneak into the end zone. Wesley, touchdown. Extra point away from tying it. Does he go for two? Nope, he's going to kick. Um, first one I have recollection of playing. Like, I th- I don't think any of my cousins, like, we used to play the N64 at my cousin's house because they were the ones that had the video game system. But they didn't really have sports games. The first football game I played was Red Favre Quarterback Club 99. The first Madden I played was probably... It wasn't until we owned a system, so it would have been 07. With Sean Alexander. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Yeah. And I okay. played that that Madden game for like four years. Like, then, yeah. like, the next one I played was 10. Because 10 was the Larry Fitzgerald, Troy Palomalu cover, right? Troy Palomalu. Yeah. 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 yeah I played that one a lot. That yeah. was the one that my, um, my, the guy who was the best man at my wedding and was my roommate in college, he had a Xbox 360. And he had that Madden game. And so we used to, when we got back from class at two o'clock, he would literally, we would like turn on some music on his uh, computer and we'd listen to music and we'd order a pizza and we'd play Madden for like six hours. Like just that's amazing. head to head. Like that's all we yeah. do. <laughs> that's amazing. Yeah. I had NFL game day, 98. And then first Madden I got was 99 on PlayStation 1. Nice throw Ooh, right side. Oh, nice dot. Oh, boy. Got a and chance he's got here. Out. He's got to throw like a... Yeah, he's got to throw something really quick, though. It's tough. NHL 94 was a classic. Yeah, everyone always talks about NHL 94. Mm-hmm. Like, still to this day. Mm-hmm. Well, because they added the NHL 94. Uh, the first yeah, NBA the game old... I played was NBA Live 99. On the computer. Yeah, the old NBA lives, I were gonna say they also were really were good. Great. I spilled all the time. Yeah, I spilled all had the fun time. With they had a great soundtrack. Sure. Yeah, those were so fun. They had the three point contest, they had the slam dunk contest, yep. like they were great. Yes. They were so and good. NBA Live 04, I think, had that one. Yep. Yeah, like NBA and Live like, like to... 02 to 06 were like mad fun. Yeah. Handoff up the middle. Good defense, though. Timeout taken. He's not going to have the kick for three. He's just going to have to chuck one up. Ooh. He's going to kick try it. Anyways. It. <laughs> 65-yard field goal for Justin Tucker for the win. Can he no way, NFL right? record it here? <laughs> kick is up. It's oh. off the crossbar. We're going to overtime. Oh, my again right off the crossbar and we have extra overtime football in our championship game with a thousand dollars on the line come on td let's watch some more men yeah not surprised (laughs) not surprised i mean how could you be Uh, maybe we maybe we can catch the fourth quarter the clippers pelicans probably not but yeah, NBA, NBA Live 04 was great. Uh, MVP Baseball yes. 05 was great. MVP ba- with Manny on the cover. Oh, man. I played with that Manny game on the cover. Hours and hours. And had yep. the Dropkick Murphys singing Tessie as the. Yes. And the Boston yes. Red Sox have won the World Series. Yes. That game I played for so long. I played so much, and I always played as the Red Sox because I loved. Uh, I was a. I was like the Red Sox. World Series year was like the first year I watched baseball like seriously um, because mm-hmm. I just wanted to see the Yankees lose. And when the Red Sox came back down 3-1, I watched every game of that series. Yep. Yep. David Ortiz. But think about it. Oh my. Next summer, next summer, hopefully we have NCAA football again. Uh, Infinite MLB Slugfest, NHL Hits, and NFL Blitz. Legends. NBA yeah, Street, NFL all three of them. NFL Street. NFL Legend. Street. I played, yeah, NFL Street was good. Woohoo! It's time to get down. All the trash talking as you were walking out of the field. Yes. Yep, yep.
First and ten for Pop and overtime. I want to play MVP baseball right now. I know, dog. It's just play. I literally, one summer in college, it was my summer after my sophomore year, I stayed at school to take some summer classes, so I lived alone in uh, the dorms for like uh, eight weeks. I legit, it was mm-hmm. just like, it was just me. And like, I, I didn't have a roommate or anything. I had my GameCube. I literally played through an entire 162 game series of MVP baseball. Oh, and man. I, oh I was man. Just, like, I had nothing else to do. So I just played, like, that yeah, game was yeah. so good. Yeah, that game was so good. Got the baby so out route. Good. Yep. There's Eric Dickerson. All right. Can Wesley lock down or will Pavin find the end zone and end this game? Pressure's on. I, by the way, didn't expect anything less from these two. Going down to the wire, going to overtime. Basically nice. a mirror match here between these two guys. Yeah, NBA Live 06. Yeah, I forget which one was the best one. I just remember 02 to like 06 NBA Lives were all good. Yeah, I was 04 was, was my game. Yeah. When I played a lot yeah. of. And I played a lot of, because um, we had them on our PC. NCAA football 99. Hmm. Yeah, I play. What, what NCAA did I play the most? I think it was like 06 with Desmond Howard on the cover. I think it was the one I played the most. Running in third and three. Whoa. Can he get it to the end zone? That's a tough throw picked off by Wesley. He found some defense and picked off Pavin in the end zone. Terrible read right there by Pavin. He, he forced it. You know, Wesley was on that the whole time with his user. I think Pavin maybe thought he could get it behind him, but not the good, not the not the right read. And now can Wesley take advantage? Remember, all he needs now is a field goal to win it. I found, uh, I'll say this, in, in the history of my life, because um, again, I, I've never like played Madden at a at a high level to want to find glitches. But in the history of my life, the only game that I've ever found a game break, like a glitch to like win games was in NCAA <laughs> yeah. like, Football 99. Because if you came out in shotgun and called halfback draw and then uh, audibled to a different formation that had a verticals play, the corner wouldn't line up with a wide receiver, so you'd have an open 60-yard touchdown every play. So with that Ohio State, I was just throwing it to David Boston the whole time. Like, look, another touchdown by 65 to nothing. I'm so good. Did you know, like, in at the time, in the moment, like, you found a glitch? Or, like, what were you thinking while you were doing that? I was thinking I found – I finally um, found a play that beats the CPU because I was nine. <laughs> so – it's not like I had I got over the top. Might have him. Might have the game. Walk it off. Wesley Giddens. He is your Friday night football number 121 champion. He picks off Pavin in the end zone and answers the touchdown zone. He'll earn 100 points in the Cup Series. And he will take home $1,000 here on Friday night football, TD. What a battle in our finals. Yeah, what a battle. Did not Nothing... I'm not surprised at all by these two. You know, down to the wire, going to overtime. Literally a mirror match. Didn't think anyone would get stopped. And then Wesley, not known for his defense, but he came up with the stop. Bad read by Pavin. Wesley takes advantage. He wins it. $1,000 in his pocket. And uh, a great run from uh, from Pavin. He'll take home 50 points for the second place finish. No cash, but he will uh, put himself in great position to qualify for that final tournament. Uh, we are back next week. Guys, our uh, Mudhead Open is uh, open for registration right now. You can put an exclamation point, compete in the chat, or head over to uh, rivalgames.com backslash fandom. Next week's tournament, we will have a